Have you ever wondered if a creature could be immortal? Sounds like a myth, right? But it's not, at least not for a certain species of jellyfish. Welcome to a journey where we'll uncover the mysteries and wonders of jellyfish. These marine creatures are not only stunningly beautiful, but their life cycles and characteristics are equally mesmerizing. From their unique reproductive methods to their ability to survive in extreme conditions, jellyfish are truly a wonder of nature. So let's dive deeper and uncover the fascinating world of these marine marvels. Contrary to their name, jellyfish aren't actually fish. They are a fascinating group of invertebrates that belong to a phylum known as Cnidaria, which includes other marine dwellers like coral and sea anemones. Unlike fish, which have backbones, jellyfish are spineless creatures, literally. Their bodies are mostly composed of water and a gelatinous substance, giving them that unique, transparent appearance. Their misleading name, jellyfish, is a common misnomer, probably owing to their aquatic habitat and their fish-like movement. Yet these creatures are far from being fish. They don't have gills or scales. They don't lay eggs. And they certainly don't have fins. Instead, they are equipped with tentacles containing specialized cells called cnidocytes, which they use for capturing their prey. So, next time you talk about these creatures, remember they're not fish, but intriguing invertebrates. They are a testament to the incredible diversity and adaptability of life under the sea. Imagine having the power to revert your age and start life anew. Sounds impossible, right? But there's a jellyfish that does exactly that. This extraordinary creature is the Turritopsis dorni, more popularly known as the immortal jellyfish. The immortal jellyfish, a fascinating specimen, has the ability to do something no other creature on Earth can do. When faced with certain threats or simply old age, it can revert its cells back to their earliest form and grow anew. This process is like a butterfly turning back into a caterpillar or a frog morphing back into a tadpole. But how does this remarkable transformation take place? Well, the immortal jellyfish undergoes a process called transdifferentiation. When it's stressed or injured, it sinks to the ocean floor and transforms its cells into a blob-like cyst. From this cyst, a polyp colony grows, which eventually buds into new jellyfish. This cycle of rebirth can continue indefinitely, giving the immortal jellyfish its moniker, but it's important to note that this doesn't make them invulnerable. They can still be consumed by predators or succumb to disease. But barring external threats, they potentially can live forever. What's even more intriguing is that the immortal jellyfish isn't born with this ability. Instead, it develops the capacity for transdifferentiation after it reaches sexual maturity. So in a sense, it's like the jellyfish earns its immortality. The discovery of the immortal jellyfish has implications far beyond marine biology. It opens up a world of possibilities in the field of medicine and aging research. While the idea of humans achieving immortality remains far-fetched, studying the mechanisms of this jellyfish might provide insights into how cells age and how this process might be slowed or even reversed. With such an incredible ability, the immortal jellyfish surely deserves its name, this creature's unique life cycle and age-reversing ability make it a standout in the vast oceanic world. As we delve deeper into the mysteries of the sea, who knows what other astounding creatures we might discover. Despite their gentle, drifting nature, jellyfish are both predators and prey in the marine world. To begin with, let's delve into the predatory side of these captivating creatures. Jellyfish are carnivorous, feeding on a menu that includes small fish, plankton, and even other jellyfish. They are equipped with a fascinating hunting mechanism, their tentacles. These slender extensions are laced with specialized cells known as cnidocytes, each containing a minuscule but potent harpoon-like stinger. When a potential meal drifts too close, these stingers are propelled outwards, injecting the unsuspecting prey with paralyzing venom. This makes capturing their meal a rather effortless task. However, not all jellyfish rely solely on their venomous tentacles for sustenance. Some larger species, like the lion's mane jellyfish, use their bell's sticky surface to ensnare tiny organisms. Once trapped, the prey is then transported to the mouth arms and ultimately to the jellyfish's mouth. Moving on, let's explore the other side of the coin, jellyfish's prey. Despite their stinging defense mechanism, jellyfish are not invincible. They have a number of predators, from the smallest to the largest. Turtles, for instance, are known to feast on jellyfish. The turtle's thick skin protects it from the jellyfish's stinging cells, making it a perfect predator. 
Certain species of fish, such as the ocean sunfish and the leatherback sea turtle, rely heavily on jellyfish for their diet. Birds, too, have been known to swoop down and snatch up these gelatinous meals. Even other jellyfish will consume their own kind when food is scarce. And let's not forget the human predator. In some cultures, jellyfish are considered a delicacy and are harvested for their meat. So while they might seem serene and harmless, jellyfish play a vital role in the marine food chain. They help maintain balance in the ocean's ecosystem, underscoring the interconnectedness of life beneath the waves. Have you ever seen the ocean turn into a sea of jellyfish? This phenomenon, known as a jellyfish bloom, is as fascinating as it is alarming. Let's delve into what causes these spectacular jellyfish blooms. Like any other living creature, jellyfish respond to changes in their environment. When conditions are just right, warm water, plenty of sunlight, and an abundant supply of plankton for food, jellyfish populations can explode in a short period of time, creating what we call a bloom. However, these blooms aren't just the result of perfect conditions. They can also be triggered by changes in the ecosystem, including overfishing and climate change. When we overfish, we eliminate the jellyfish's natural predators and competitors for food. This allows the jellyfish population to grow unchecked. Similarly, as our oceans warm due to climate change, jellyfish, which thrive in warmer waters, are given a larger area in which to live and reproduce. Now you may be wondering, what's the big deal? So there are a few more jellyfish in the sea. What impact could that possibly have? Well, jellyfish blooms can have significant implications for both the ecosystem and human activities. For the ecosystem, these blooms can deplete the ocean of oxygen and essential nutrients, endangering other marine life. They can also disrupt the food chain, as jellyfish consume large amounts of plankton, leaving less food for other marine creatures. As for human activities, jellyfish blooms can pose a threat to tourism, as swarms of jellyfish can deter beachgoers. They can also clog up fishing nets and even cause power outages by blocking the cooling intakes of coastal power plants. In essence, while jellyfish blooms are a fascinating spectacle, they also serve as a stark reminder of the delicate balance of our marine ecosystems and how our actions can tip the scales. Jellyfish blooms, an incredible yet potentially dangerous phenomenon, are a testament to the adaptability of these marine creatures. From immortality to massive blooms, jellyfish are truly enigmatic creatures. They stand as a testament to the incredible diversity and adaptability of life under the sea. As we've explored, these creatures, despite their name, are not fish at all, but rather invertebrates with a unique life cycle. Perhaps the most captivating fact is the immortality of the Turritopsis dorni, a jellyfish species that can revert its cells back to their earliest form and grow anew. It's an unbelievable phenomenon that has captured the interest of scientists worldwide, and it's a stark reminder of the mysteries that still lie within our oceans. Furthermore, jellyfish play a dual role in the marine ecosystem. They are both predators and prey, hunting small marine animals while also providing sustenance for larger species. It's a delicate balance that underscores their importance in the food chain. But jellyfish are not just solitary creatures. They can form massive groups known as blooms, a sight that's as breathtaking as it is potentially dangerous. These blooms highlight the jellyfish's ability to thrive and adapt in changing oceanic conditions. In summary, whether it's their puzzling life cycle, their role in the ecosystem, or their ability to form massive blooms, jellyfish are a fascinating testament to the wonders of the marine world. So, the next time you spot a jellyfish, remember, there's more to these floating gelatinous creatures than meets the eye.